My name is Dimitris Pavlakis. I'm an industry analyst in ABI Research, and I work in cybersecurity, biometrics, and IoT technologies. Facial recognition is a biometric technology that attempts to identify individuals based on facial characteristics. Face recognition has prospered from many other um, technologies that are increasing in tandem, like machine learning, artificial intelligence, machine vision. Biometric experts have created liveness detection for face recognition, which can help alleviate some of the issues regarding spoofing, face recognition authentication. The good thing about facial recognition is that it is merging, if you will, with a number of uh, interesting applications, especially in the IT. Those could be automotive, smart home, smart city environments. Border control, of course, is already quite prevalent, as is with uh, consumer electronics. Both uh, authentication and surveillance have a, both an, an active and a passive component. Usually for the authentication is more of the active one because users want to be authenticated and for the surveillance is more of a passive one. First of all, the security concerns regarding the data, if the data are protected, how they're stored, for how long they're stored, um, then it has to do with the, of course, ethical consideration because uh, many people feel that it will invade their privacy. Innovation and technological progress should not exclude responsibility. Regulation is very important. It's actually innovative companies that take into account data privacy, regulatory concerns that can not only address the current ethical considerations for the use of biometric data and face recognition, but also that will have um, a greater impact in how the technology evolves over time in a safe and secure manner.